Ray County, there is a new approach that they hope will shut down the recent spike in catalytic converter thefts. Action News 8 reporter Ariana Hasso joins us in studio with more on how the program works. Yeah, Dan, Aaron, catching and tracking down stolen catalytic converters is extremely hard for law enforcement. That's why this plan is to engrave numbers on them in hopes to not only deter criminals, but to also make it, make it easier to find them. It's almost like watching a, a race with a pit crew. They're hitting the car and they've removed these, these items very quickly. In Seaside alone last year, there were 50 reported thefts. The uptick in thefts is countywide and why the Monterey County District Attorney's Office is getting involved. They're very expensive to replace. A lot of times insurance doesn't cover it, so they're very frustrated because law enforcement can't do anything to help. The DA's office is teaming up with Salinas Toyota and offering a new identification program for residents. By marking the catalytic converters with particular identifying information and actually marking them as stolen so that if someone is in possession of them, law enforcement can ide immediately identify that the item is stolen and who the item belongs to. Paccioni says this will help law enforcement connect the victims to the stolen converters and will help put buyers on notice that they're accepting stolen items. Last weekend, Pacific Grove police caught thieves in the act, which they say doesn't happen too often. They're very quick at what they do and often they're, they're working in hours of darkness in the middle of the night and they'll, they'll show up, hit a car, and they're gone within a minute or two. Auto experts say this new ID program can help to a certain degree, but needs the cooperation of catalytic converter buyers. To follow through on those numbers and confirming that that converter comes from a legit source or that it was um, uh, taken off for a specific reason. A welding chain around the converter also helps. On the whole length of the converter, and part of the tubing from the inlet and outlet of the converter. But the biggest piece of advice, a car alarm. A regular car alarm would do so much because these newer uh, car alarms that come installed on the vehicles really don't help much. It would just trigger the alarm and, and the, the thieves would uh, immediately stop. Police also urge you to call if you hear it happening in the middle of the night. In the DA's office, just let me know that all the slots are already filled up, filled up by noon today, but they are working on another date. So to keep updated on those dates, follow their Facebook page at Monterey County District Attorney's Office. Dan, Aaron? All right, an indication that it's a service that people want. Exactly. All right, all right. thanks, Ari. Thanks, Ari.